who thought this was a good idea? Who on earth thought the Daredevil needed a sequel? Not a Netflix TV show, the movie. And who on earth thought that Daredevil needed a sequel that focused on the side character who died in the middle of the movie? Whoever thought this, I hope they were fired and beaten with a gigantic pole because now we're looking at Elektra. Those of you who've erased that the movie from their, from your mind, I honestly don't blame you. Daredevil was a bad movie that focused on the titular hero, where he beat up a bunch of guys and did things happen, and you know, honestly just watched the whole video yourself. Elektra was a character in the plot, or just Daredevil's love interest, and ultimately died in the middle of the movie, and are getting the final push for the third act. And yeah, she does die and come back in the comics, but that's because she's a member of The Hand, who are a ninja death cult with the tendency to, you know, take the corpses of superheroes of super important people and bring them back as ninja death zombies. But, in this case, why is there an Electra movie? Well, maybe if you look at the plot, we'll get a rough idea about why this movie exists. After her death in Daredevil, Electra was revived by Stick. Basically, he's Daredevil's Obi-Wan Kenobi, the one who helped him with his powers in the first place. She, Stick begins teaching her this form of martial arts to grant her the ability of precognition, as well as the ability to bring back the dead. So he must be a member of the Hand, but the Hand don't use martial arts for this, they use mystical mumbo jumbo compounds for this. Still not finding out the point of all this. Anyway, because she never get over her inner rage, she can't really finish the training, and so quits and becomes an assassin. Well, Basically, she just goes back to me, which was before, minus having a rich father. She finds a father and daughter pair who are her contracted hits, and begins protecting them from the hand. A group of ninjas, a group of ninja assassins. The hand wants the girl because she's a major martial arts prodigy, similar to Electra herself, which further causes the pair to have a bond. Electra fights the assassins one after another, meant to save the father and daughter, and hands them off the stick for safekeeping, before basically giving stick a shrug saying that they're cool and running off for the end. Wow, this movie felt entirely pointless. I still don't see the point about why this thing exists. This movie, again, feels entirely pointless. So, I have a serious question to ask you. Why does this movie even exist? Was there anyone out there begging for a return of Electra's character. I know Jennifer Gardner looks good, and again, Jennifer Gardner does try her best in this movie, but I honestly don't see the appeal, even from the original Daredevil movie, I don't see Electra's appeal in this at all. In the comic, Electra has a bit more of a personality, while in this movie she's just anger, rage, and hatred. Same thing in Daredevil, she was made to be Daredevil's foil in that movie, and in this movie she pretty much serves the same purpose. Without being someone to foil, well, without someone there to be the foil. She pretty much is the foil for the little girl character, but that's just to help Electra grow and evolve as a person. But again, it ultimately is importantly like, because her her growing and evolving as a person doesn't ultimately help her master that whole martial arts to let her bring back the dead thing. It's just for her own character development, which you think would go into a second movie. But again, this movie flopped harder than Daredevil, so why did there be a second movie? And Daredevil flopped too, so why do you think there'll be a second movie? Overall, again, this movie feels utterly pointless. Honestly, I have a hard time remembering that this thing even existed. I guess that's where it deserves to be, honestly, in the realm of obscurity. A place where no one can find it, and no one can assume it has any decent value. So, why don't we just return it back to where it came? The realm of nothing.